I'm, I'm really excited about the, the possibility of multiple new technologies coming together and allowing us to tackle questions that just a few years ago we, you know, we couldn't even dream that we could uh, answer them. Uh, one of them is single cell technologies, uh, but then also massive proteomics advances um, and uh, the access to human tissues that we have that allows us to put multiple uh, dimensions together um, to, to really tackle these questions of why does the brain um, age and why does it become so susceptible to neurodegenerative diseases and um, again how could we potentially slow that process down.